Hey guys, I've been doing a review on the um, 10 piece set you get for your previous Vita from Amazon, shipped from Crazy on Digital, which is in Livermore. Um, you get uh, four clear. You get four cases. You get this clear, which I think is white one, and you get this cool black one that covers your buttons and it covers everything. What makes your PS Vita look just all black? And then you get this blue one, and then you get this purple one. Honestly, my favorite one would be the black one because it will like I want my well basically it just covers your whole entire PS Vita just black like you can still see the these parts right here. We well, can't see this bottom part, but you can see the the hinges, whatever hooks things at the sides but that's it makes it look cool but it's still easier back test can open like how all the other cases do and it, uh, which what it doesn't have is doesn't have the grip things like like the dots like this at the sides but so my fingers slip sometimes like but it's cool it's nice I'll be showing you how all the cases look on the PS Vita after I show you what else it comes with. Well, it also comes with a car charger, um, the USB cable for it, and this other charger for your outlet. And then it comes with it comes with a hard shell case, and it comes with it comes with uh, this thing so you can hook onto your backpack. Or whatever you're taking it, like a luggage. But I forgot to mention that it comes with um, a screen protector. That's cool. And then, but what sucks about it is that it doesn't say um, PS Vita on it, which I thought was kind of cool. And it doesn't show um, your button glowing, the PS button. So like, you know, it shines blue and orange sometimes. So. Like, but it's okay. I like it still. It's nice. Um, it's very smooth. Um, it just makes your PS Vita feel slick, nice, and smooth. And you see, you can still um, charge your PS Vita, put your things in. It doesn't affect anything. I really don't think it affects the Wi-Fi on this, but it's good and that's how the black case looks like on it and I'll be showing you the blue one next. This is what it looks like with the blue case on. I think it looks great and excellent but the bad thing about this is that it like it, it still shows a little black right here but you can't cover it up. Um, it's nice it's like the black one except it doesn't cover the buttons and it has grips at the side it's really nice I like it and huh, it doesn't it still doesn't show the um, PS button at right here but I think it looks excellent blue and black blue is one of my favorite colors so this is really nice and I'll be showing you the purple one next um, this is the purple one it looks nice I think it looks very slick and nice like the black one. Uh, you can kind of see through it and see the PS Vita button. And you can still kind of see kind of showing blue at the sides but uh, where the PS button is. Uh, it doesn't, it really doesn't affect the speaker that much just like it covers it a little but I don't see any effect in it but it has grips at the side and you still have you're charging your I forgot what it's called your thing for your headphones uh, and then you have your memory stick thing and you can still put your games in and stuff it doesn't affect anything so you don't have to take the case off to put a new game in or to charge it um, or to plug your thing in your headphones in and it really doesn't I haven't tried the camera on it yet and I'm pretty sure it doesn't affect the camera because you can still see it's cut out for the camera. 
it really doesn't affect it. It's nice if it's smooth like the black one. And if it's perfectly on the PS Vita. Um, I like the blue one. It just it just doesn't fit that well on it. It fits it fits very well, but what annoys me is the top top of it. On the blue one. But it's still nice. Next I'll be showing you the last one, the clear one. Um all the the purple one and the blue one. The white one's just like all of the purple ones and the blue one, but unlike the black one. Um it, uh when you're putting it on you don't have to be very careful with it because there's this part, um, you know, you might like feel like, Oh no, I don't wanna rip it when you're putting it on. Because you have to like it's kinda hard for me to put I mean it's easy for me to put it on because I know it could take a lot of strength. So like right here you might think, Oh, it doesn't stretch very far, but yes, it stretches if you go very far. Um, what I like about it is that like white and black is very nice put together. Um it was a good idea, but you know, if you have a white PHV, I don't know how it'll look, but it'll look, I'm pretty sure it'll look really nice still. Um, you can see through this one, the PS button, very nice. That's what I like about this one very much. So, you know, like, oh, I just like the light. I just like the blue light, basically. And, yeah, that's, that's what it looks like with all the cases. Next, I'll be showing you the hard shell case and what's inside of it. So, when you get the vault case, it comes with this weird smell. Well, it did for mine, but it came with a very weird smell, and then, oh, I just closed it. I thought I opened it, and then, well, it just kind of gave me a headache. I try to wash it off, but, I mean, like, I try to scrub it off with the wet piece of paper, but I don't think it didn't work. So, I'm just going to try to wipe it off with a sanitary napkin or something. But, when you, um... What's cool about this is that you can put your games, and obviously it holds your PS Vita. Hold on. But then, the weird, like, the thing you have to be very careful when you put your games in here, that it could slip. It, it really could slip. The games could slip out if you open it, and it just flings open, like, here you go, I'm putting my games in there. That's Call of Duty Black Ops, just to tell you. I'm just I'm not only just gonna put two games in there. But like see I when you're closing it, you don't want any open space to be out so this game to slip out, but like like I just like move it around a little. Oh. Oh well the games didn't slip out. Well you have to be very careful because the games could slip out like that, easily like that. And then like because the thing right here, you all, like, the net does not stick to it very well, like, how it's supposed to be, like, you know, when you stretch it, like, all those other cases. But it still puts the game in there very well. Put my game back in this case. Okay, so... Yeah, that's what's good about the vault. I mean, that's what the only con about the vault case is that your games can slip up. But it very holds your PS Vita very nice. It's strong. It's thick. It's not cheap. Whatever, it's cheap and you put it. It's not very cheap like all the other ones. It's nice. It's strong. If you drop it, most likely it will not. Your PS Vita will not break. But if you drop it from really high, like I don't know. Who's, who's eight foot and playing a PS Vita and drop it? I'm pretty sure it will. I'm pretty sure it will not break. Most likely, there's a fifty fifty chance it will break. But um, it's very nice still. I like it. It holds your PS Vita well, and then it's it's very nice. And then what I like about it is that it has this very nice metallic looking circle it's plastic I think still nice well and I think it's supposed to look like the PS Vita a little how it's dented out I don't, I don't think so actually but it's still nice I like it it's a nice clean clear case nice clean case not clear 